<laughs> you ready? Yeah. You look so white. It's the light. Mm hmm. Let me on the light. See, I love the shirt. It's like... Teamwork makes the dream work? Yeah. High five. Okay. <laughs> ready? Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. It's been a long time since we've sat down and had a uh, talks for video, but today I wanted to do something fun, something a little bit different and interesting. Um, and I wanted to do a video about how my husband and I met. I actually realized that I have never introduced him, formally introduced him to you guys. So, hey guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is my husband Miloš. He's not fond of the camera, so today was like pulling teeth and as you can tell his face is already getting red. So it might be a long one. Actually the story of how we met is not really long, is it? Uh, not really. No, not really. Um, it's a very short one, but over the years, we've been married for five years now, uh, over the years the story changed as to how we met. I'll tell the story first and then you can tell your version of the story. Okay. So we have a mutual we have a mutual friend, right? Yeah. That um, used to come to a place where I used to work. At the time, I worked at the gym, at a gym, a local gym. And uh, she'd come in and tell me, oh my gosh, there's this guy, he's so cute. She told me, him, so cute. And then I was like, mm, uh, I don't know, whatever, okay, whatever. And I, was, I wasn't trying to commit to anything. And then one day she came in and she brought a picture of him. And I was like, hmm, okay, he's all tatted up. And uh, as you can tell, he's showing his sleeve. And he's got a big one in the back that he got after we got together without my permission. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, um, so she showed me the picture and I was like, oh my gosh, okay, he's kind of cute, a little tatted up, but he kind of looks short. <laughs> I'm 5'8", how tall are you? I don't know, 5'6". Five, five, You're not 5'6". <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so I was like, he's kind of short, but you know, l let me see what he's like. like Pass along my phone number. Is that what happened? No. No. Uh, I didn't. I didn't give her. You didn't get my number from no, me, did you? No, actually, you showed me a picture of me. No, no, no. Before you came, did you ever see pictures of me before you met me? No. You didn't. Okay. So she just said, "Come to the gym. That's where she works." Who? Shannon. No, I started. I started. Uh, I started I joined the gym, but I didn't see you for like a few days and then you But why did point. you join the gym? Did you know I was working there? No, I was uh, going with Jason. You're such a liar. Oh, I think I joined the gym only because <laughs> of you. <laughs> I joined the gym because I needed the gym. No, but yeah! you so you've never heard of me at all. Uh, You're such a liar. I did not. I didn't. I'm going to have to call Shani oh, okay, and call her story because I don't yeah. believe you. Yeah. I mean, I didn't even sh know. Sh actually, I knew Shannon. Yeah, but she never mentioned anything about you. After five years of marriage, you the first time the I'm hearing about Shannon. this. Yeah, right. You always hear like after like a while. Uh, what was I saying? The. the uh, like Shannon, did she, she didn't give you my number. Yeah, no, she did not. I didn't even know you knew Shannon until you showed me a picture. Because I knew she took that picture. My husband yeah. bangs on the fact that I have a terrible memory, and mm -hmm. then he just makes these things up, yeah, yeah, and then yeah. I'm stuck because I don't remember. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so <laughs> this mutual friend, Shannon, tells me about him. She's like, he's gonna start joining the gym. You should look out for him. This is what he looks like. I'm like, okay, fine, whatever. And then one Saturday, and on Saturdays are very slow at the gym anyway, um, it was empty, completely empty. And this guy, Walks in. I was at the, the other side of the gym, so then I walked back sure in. It was Saturday, because I usually don't work out on the weekends. Okay, there we go again. Yeah. It was totally a Saturday. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. So I walk in, and he's like bent over at the fountain drinking. And I, I know I knew all my people that used to come to the gym all the time, and I knew what schedules they were because I was there all the time. And I knew that this was a new person that I'd never seen before. Mm -hmm. So the first thing I said to you was Do you remember? Something about water? No, something about water, no. I said, who are you? Because oh, yeah, I didn't know who yeah, you were, yeah, you know? Yeah. And you being the cheeky bugger that you are, he turned around and says, who are you? Obviously, I work well, there. I haven't seen you before. Yeah, it but it was, was your like, first time at the gym. No, it wasn't. No, it wasn't. It was uh, okay. the first few days for like the other two guys. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So okay. I haven't seen you. So anyway, that was the first time that we met. And mm -hmm. I was like, okay, he's funny and he's got, you know, nice energy i was reading his energy felt good and i was like okay whatever so now 
the, the way that the gym is laid out is that my like the people come in through the door right to the table at the front and then they check in and they sign up for class or whatever and then to the one side with like the weights and the machines and whatever and then on the other side people could stretch and do all different kinds of yeah. things so ah oh, the light anyway so my husband would work out on this side and then he would ch -ch 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 over to the other side right i always go warm up in one side and i go work out on the other side <laughs> where the equipment is like yeah anyway so he was walking by and every time he'd walk by me he'd be like Okay, that's not true. <laughs> that's not true. That's not true. That's not true. That's not true. That's it was totally true. showing off. No, 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 no. And then he was making these no. loud noises like, Ugh. <laughs> that, that wasn't me, that was Jason, probably. <laughs> Didn't make noise. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh. No, the boy is up. Well, the thing is, obviously, our introduction have two versions your version and the real version. But, <laughs> really? yes. The real version, really? Yeah. Okay, so tell me your real version then. What was it? Well, I'm sure it was not Saturday, and the sure I'm not making sounds, I wasn't flexing. So, <laughs> let's continue. Anyway, so after that day, did we switch numbers right away? Actually, no, you showed me a picture of you. Uh, picture, uh, the picture of me on your phone. Oh, yeah, okay, so right. Like, how do you get a picture? So, because you have my picture, then I'm gonna need your picture, right? He was flirting with me, and that's how he was flirting with me. Mm. So, uh, you sent me your picture, and I said, Ooh, what a cute girl. Should I invite her for a dinner or something? And you were like, Ooh, I don't know, maybe. I'm like, Okay, I'm gonna invite her. So then you give me a number. No, I had to have given you my number before in order to give you my picture. Well, you sent a picture on my phone. So actually, I give you my number. Any so it was part of a trick of you. <laughs> yeah, so you can give me your number. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah. Anyway, your face tells that you're lying. You see, the perks of being a melanoid is that even when you are fibbing, it doesn't show. Zoe, yeah. what's all this noise, honey? Nothing. Oh, the perks of being a parent, right? They interrupt you at every turn. Anyway, so then we exchange numbers um and then he did this thing right because our schedules were very different and conflicting and we couldn't sort of put together a day or figure out a time yeah i was working p.m you're working a. yes i was working in the morning he was working in the evening and so then what he started doing was he would make me food because he was like i'm gonna go home to cook and i was like oh, you don't have to try and impress me with your lies i know you can cook and he was like oh really and then he would bring me food at work right at the highest traffic times you'd wait until they're like most well, people standing the at the front of the gym i was on the way to i don't know where i was going so mm -hmm. i just drop by and give you a food and i left <laughs> so he'd come yeah. in and <laughs> okay that, that's not true but <laughs> and he wouldn't say it was sometimes there's so many people standing around and he just like put my lunch on the table and the girls would squeal like oh my god there's a guy there's a guy <laughs> so he did that like, for, for a couple times before we went out, I was impressed. At that point, I was like, okay, he can cook and he brings me lunch to work and this is nice, you know? Mm -hmm. And then it wasn't until for like two weeks to be able to go on a first date, right? Or more? Uh, well, the first time I gave you food, we went out that night. Oh, but again, <laughs> but again, lies. So, okay. Okay, like this is not how the story went. Can you imagine what it's going to be like in 10 years? Anyway, so then we went on our first date and the rest is history because five years later there's two children <laughs> and some people have lost memory um like at, at the end of the video anyway guys as you can see the whole family's joined us now so we are gonna just wrap it up but um thank you so so much for watching <laughs> i can't speak um please comment like and subscribe and tell us um your stories of how you and your partners and your spouses met um, and then we will be back here on again soon. Oh boy, easy son, easy. Yeah, these days it's a little bit hard to film, but I'll try and get one up as soon as possible. All right, take care. Bye. 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 Bye.